Um, I think they have to get pretty uncomfortable. And what I mean by that is because capability is not built quickly, you have to really build the capabilities that are beyond needed needed now. And that's hard because we let the, you know, the, what's the tyranny of the urgent. And uh, so I like to push to say, listen, for every capability you build that you need right now, think about one that you really need to start getting a pipeline around, be it either because you decided that seal is going to be internal and you want to build it because you don't even know what it's going to look like and you need to start to scan the landscape for it. But the, the data and the analytics is getting far more intelligent than any of us. You're going to need to either have people inside who can leverage that outside world of specialists, or you're going to need to decide that in your ecosystem, that's something you want to be good at. But in the capability space and in terms of what we build our organizations around, we have to go pretty far. And that's not always fun. And I always tell people, listen, there's some capabilities I know you can go buy now in, um, outside, but the ones that are going to trip you up later on are the ones you go, nobody outside can do this for me and nobody inside can do this for me. So that would definitely be one. The other thing I would say, and I always want to caution is we get so excited and, and I have been there. The CEOs are so excited about the data abundance in marketing right now. And, and it is a data abundance that you can almost get addicted to the ROI that you get so addicted to the ROI, you won't let anything not have an ROI. And if we do that, marketing risks um, an emotional scarcity. And if marketing starts to become a space of emotional scarcity, um, then we lose our meaning and then you see the problem that we have. So the other thing I would say is they build their organization is hold that tension with their leaders and don't just train them to believe that we can measure everything we do because we can measure a lot more than we ever could. But you know, the human condition is still the human condition. And I think marketing has to kind of guard that to a degree. So that would be my, my other one. Um, and then last but not least, I would just keep saying, think about your ecosystem and think about designing your teams in ways that aren't all owned by you, but really feel more like, more like a network.